Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make an automatic PWM battery charger. This charger can be used for 12 volt or 24 volt battery. The charger can automatically detect whether the battery is 12 volt or 24 volts. So without further ado, let's start this video. This video is sponsored by PCB GoGo, which is one of the most experienced PCB manufacturing company of China. First, I have designed the PCB layout and also generated the Gerbo files. And go to PCBGoGo.com and click on Instant Code and select all required parameters such as material, board type, PCB size, quantity, solder mask color, silk screen color and a few more options. Then I click on Calculate and select my country and click on Add to Basket. After that, I have uploaded the Gerber files and click on Submit PCB. After that, the order will be added to the shopping cart. Then I click on Proceed and add my shipping address and select my desired shipping and payment method. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. These are my other channels, do subscribe them as well. And you can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Component list, circuit diagram, everything is in the description below. An Arduino is used to give the intelligence to the system. The system uses 5 MOSFETs and can give 40 amperes of current. All the MOSFETs are connected parallel to each other to boost the current. An optocoupler is used to isolate the Arduino and MOSFETs. The optocoupler is connected to the pin D9 of Arduino which generates the PWM signal. A short key diode is used to isolate the battery positive from the input positive. A buck regulator is used to convert the battery voltage to 5 volt to supply the Arduino. A 2 pin terminal block is used as an input terminal. Another 2 pin terminal block is used for the output terminal. 6 LEDs are used to indicate the battery level. I have made PCBs for the system. Let's connect all the components onto the PCB and test it. So we have soldered all the components onto the PCB. Now let's upload the code to Arduino and test the project. So this is the complete battery charger. Let's connect the supply and battery to the charger and test it.
first we need to connect the input supply and then connect the battery to the output terminal and the system will automatically detect the battery voltage and start charging the battery. The system uses PWM technique to step down the voltage. The duty cycle of the PWM signal is inversely proportional to the battery voltage. When battery voltage rises, the duty cycle decreases. Thank you. 